Welcome back and we are starting off the January transfer with the signing of Mukiele for £18.5 million, a young new centre-back. And here is the signing of Jonathan Okone for £20 million, replacing Castellejo on the right wing. And the first sale, Laxal sold to Arsenal for £9.3 million. And here we go, Diego Perotti, an old signing of 7.7 .7 million to be a sub left winger just because we needed someone and for not a lot of money. Now the transfers are out of the way, straight into the first game of this episode against Sampdoria, using what I call the first team of this tournament. Let's see how we get on. And it's a 3-0 win, starting off the episode really strong. Goals from Castellejo, Bodu and Kessie. Game 2 against Caglieri this time, using the same team our strongest 11 most likely, can we get another good result? And a 3-1 win, goals from Liao, Kessie, and two from Kessie this time. In we go against SPAL using our second 11 this time, can we still get that good result against a weak team? 2-0, so doing well, Rebic and Castellejo with the goals, cleaning up against SPAL. Against Udinese now, using our first team this time again with the new additions of course added in can we get a result 1-0 scraping that win a goal from Donny van der Beek but also a red card a goal against Brestica this time obviously no Donny van der Beek so we're using our second team this time can we get a result here we go, 2-1 win, Ibrahimovic and Rebic with the goals, sealing that win. And here we go, the big derby at the San Siro, Inter Milan, AC Milan. First playthrough game using our first team, everyone's back in. Let's go. So Inter on the attack here with Lukaku on the ball, what nice one two of Alexis Sanchez. And they're keeping the ball, but there's a lot of pressure on them from the Milan defence, especially Calabria, still putting that pressure on, but they swing across in. And Hernandez takes it. Van der Beek playing it out to Dero Son. Playing it nicely around the midfield. Can we counter here? There's a run on. And Bodu making the run. Kessie's played in quite wide though. Can they rescue something from here? Bodu holding it up. Cuts it back to Akone. Cuts it back again. Oh, nice clearance. But only out to Hernandez. Van der Beek on the ball. He plays it to Kessie. Plays it into Bodu who turns. Can he shoot? Off the post. Ball comes back out to Calabria. Still putting his pressure on. Kessie, Van der Beek, Bodu again. Turns, lovely. In it goes. Finally, with that goal after a long build-up. Well-deserved. And the celebration, of course, against the rivals in the San Siro. What a goal. Nice play here. One, two. Great turn. Bang. In it goes. Near post. 1-0. And here we go, the ref surely going to blow the whistle any second now, and that is it. A nice 1-0 away win to Inter Milan in the Cup. So through we go. That's exactly what we needed right there. Here we go, next match against Hellas Verona using our first team once again. Can we keep up this good run of results? Let's find out. And a 2-0 win, both goals to Liao, good win against the weaker side. Here we go against Inter for the second time in this episode. Can we get a good result using our first team again, but have to sim this time. And it's a 2-0 loss, Eriksson and Brozovic with the goals, poor performance from us. Here is the Juventus team for this game, the playthrough using our second team because it's the first leg in the cup. The cup semi-final is underway and we've picked up the ball with Daniele Perotti. Tries to play the max low through but Juventus pick up the ball. Dybala playing it through to Rabio. We're trying to get the tackle off but we just can't. Lacazette the new signing plays it through to Dybala. Save from the keeper and our defender has literally fallen over it and out for a corner. Pjanic to swing the corner in. In it goes. It's a good delivery. The ball's just popping around everywhere. Again, not another scrambly goal but there it is. That is 1-0 Juventus in the cup. Cristiano Ronaldo in the right place at the right time, as he usually is, just slots it in the corner. Awful goal. Juventus on the attack again with Ramsey and Carvajal playing nicely. We're trying to put the pressure up, but Lacazette's holding the ball off here. 
Ramsey down the right. Is he going to swing it in? Yes, he does. Dybala, what a volley. What a goal. Surely Donnarumma should have cut that out or at least put up more pressure. But Dybala with the win. Camera celebration as well. Right, can we get a bit of a comeback going here? Conte he has the ball down the right. Plays in at Castellejo, the new second team right winger, who is keeping the ball back to Conte. Conte, sorry. Ibrahimovic, Rebic with a lovely turn. Can he shoot and finish? Nice finesse into the right-hand side of the goal. Keeper had no chance. Let's take another look at that one. Here we go. Nice Conti into Ibra. Lovely turn from Rebic. Simple finish. Good pressure from Juventus, but not enough. Here we go. We've picked up the ball in our own box. We're going to try and play this out now down the line to Castellejo. Can we get an equaliser in the 72nd minute of this game? Castellejo still going. He's looking for an option inside. Ibrahimovic provides that. Shoots. In it goes. Near post goal. What a shock. But that is all we need for this game. Who cares? In it goes. Nice little run down the wing from Castellejo. And a good finish from Ibra, Ibra in the top right-hand corner. Here we go. It's right at the end of the game. Surely the ref is going to blow the whistle anytime soon. We'll be defending for our lives to keep this draw. And there we go. Two all draw against Juventus in the first leg of the cup semi-final. We will take that every day. Back to the Serie A now with a game against Lise away using our first team this time. Can we get a good result? Let's find out. And it is a 2 0 win. Kone, Ikone and Robagnoli getting the goals. Bigger game in Serie A now against Roma. Again, using our first team because we should really. And here we go. Can we get a result? 2 1 win. Bodu and Van der Beek with the goals. That is a big win for us. An away match against SPAL now. Again, using the first team. Can we keep this run going? Another loss for SPA. Oh, that's at least four in a row. Liao, Van der Beek, Mukiele, and Calabria out with the goals. A game against Lazio this time. First team again for the fourth game in a row. Can we get a big win here against rivals? It's a 3 2 win. Van der Beek with a brace and Bodu with the goals. Nullifying their goals. A sim game against Juventus this time. First team this time as well in the Serie A. Can we get a result? Even a draw here would be okay. And it is a draw. Van der Beek getting our goal. Ronaldo getting this. And randomly, release clause paid for Krunic by Leicester City in the middle of the season. Nowhere near the transfer window. Here we go into the April game against Napoli. Using the first team once again to try and secure another win towards this title push. Here we go, Dilrosan with a throw into Van der Beek, who's playing it nicely across the pitch to Kessie. Kessie's breaking forward, plays it into Liao. 1-2, through again to Bodu. In it goes, nice and simple. That's all you need, pass, pass, pass. And we'll break down this Napoli defence. That's all it needs. Nice and simple, good link-up play from the two young strikers and across into the front post, goal. Napoli with the ball in the midfield, playing it around. We're trying to put the pressure on. Can we get the ball back? They play it out to Insigne on the wing, who cuts in, past, shoots. In it goes, Insigne across the keeper, top right corner. Good goal, one all. Great pick out to find Insigne. Good little cut in past the centre back and in. Mukiele with the first mistake. The ball's played out to the wing. Samedo. We win the ball back. Can we counter? Break, break, break. Dirasun on the ball, sprinting towards the halfway line. Keeps going out wide and down the left. Cuts in the ball into Liao. Bodu's free. Plays Bodu in. He's being pressured. He's got the space. Across the keeper, in it goes. Nice goal. 2 1. And it's surely the ref's going to blow the whistle any second now. There we go. That is a 2-1 win against Napoli. 
top of the table clash. Hopefully that secures us in a good position to keep challenging for the title and the Champions League spaces. And here we are looking to build on the success from the win against Napoli versus Parma. This time the second team is out. Can we get the result we want? No, Ibra and Pequeta are picking up a goal, but a draw, two all. Here we go, next game. Can we win this time against Bologna? The first team are back out after the disappointment of the second team. Can we get a result here? 2-0, much better. Liao and Dilro Sun with the goals. Here we go, Sassuolo away. Can we get the result we need? One all, not quite. Atalanta now at home. This is a big game. Atalanta always a tough part opponent. We are into May now. Can the first team get a result? One all, another draw. This is not going well. Surely we're probably out of the title. Here we go, away to Sampdoria this time, using the second team, but no Ibrahimovic. So, Liao is playing with the second team. Can we get a result? There we go, 1-0 win. Pequeta getting the goal to secure that victory. Here we go. It's the big one. It's the cup final. The first team are at it again. The best team. All the relationships. Let's go. Genoa with the ball, but intercepted. Bodu on the edge of the box, nice bit of skill. Can he find someone or can he take on the shot? He cuts it back to Van der Beek. 1-0, what a start. What a start. The big player for the big games. There he is, Donny van der Beek. The biggest signing of the series so far. Bodu really held off his defender well, waited for the, the run from van der Beek and there he is. In it goes. Great finish. Right, here we go with a break. Kessie's running towards that halfway line, looking for a runner. He's waiting for someone. No one seems to show. Liao's gone. There we go, Bodu. Better. Looking for another run. Liao's peeled off. Van der Beek finds Liao again. In it goes. 2-0. What a start. This is exactly what we needed in the cup final. Make them chances count. In it goes. Get in. Good play from all round, to be honest. Van der Beek, nice simple ball. The out, bang. Top right hand corner. Gennaro on the ball here. Trying to get a bit of a comeback going. A simple pass intercepted. Nope, they've earned it back. Crossed. Head up. In. 2-1. Poor goal to concede. We've got possession of the ball, but we've given it to them. Like, in our, on the edge of our own box. And they've made the most of their chance. Fair on them. Good dudes. Donnarumma should maybe do a bit better. The header is straight at him, but very close in. He'll be disappointed with that one. Okay. Genoa looking to break again from uh, AC corner, but we've picked up the ball. Van der Beek on the edge of the box. Liao. Liao, in it goes, 3-1. So simple there. Failed counter-attack because no one was left up for them and we literally just get the ball in the box and fire in. Simple as that. Literally, three passes and shoot. A corner for AC Milan now, swung in. Can someone win it? Oh, own goal. Donny van der Beek celebrates, but from his corner, that is an own goal. The centre-back, or the, the Genoa player, with an absolute nightmare heading it back into his own net. Under pressure, goalkeeper dives out the way trying to get a fist to it, but in it goes. Ouch. Here we are, 4-1 in the cup final. Genoa on the attack. But nope, Kessie has tackled Falk out to Dilro Sun, who's getting closed down nicely, but plays a good ball forward into Liao. Nice cut back. Is he looking for a run-up? 
Or is he taking it in his own? Oh, he's taking it in his own. Hat trick. Liao with the hat trick in the cup final. And can AC counter attack here? Picked up the ball on the edge of their own box. Kessie's running forward. He's looking for a runner. Liao has got it. He's played in Bodu. Bodu with a bit of work to do here. Pushed over, surely. Nope. AC throwing. Thought it was a penalty. Can we get this out of the way quickly? Calabria to Kessie. To Van der Beek. To Liao. Is he going for number four? Yes, he does. And he gets it. Easy as you like. Liao has absolutely run riot in this game. And won AC the cup. Surely. Surely this is it. Very simple goal. Still had a bit to do. But in it goes. Surely this is going to be it now. It's too late for him to come back. 6-1. There we go. The cup is ours. The cup is our 6-1. Four goals from Liao. Van der Beek starting us off and an own goal. They will be gutted, you know. But well deserved. And let's enjoy the celebration together. After that great success in the cup, here we go. The last game of the season. Can we secure our Champions League place? Can we do it? And that is a win. 2-0 Liao and Ikone with the goals, surely. So here is the final Serie A table. So as you can see, we come in third place after all games are played. Joint on points with Napoli and the same goal difference. So we come third by scoring two less goals, even though we conceded two less goals than Napoli as well. But very tight at the top of the table, even Inter in fifth with 87 points. So Champions League spot, we have a chance next season to finish the return to glory. And as we just saw, AC Milan win the cup 6-1 in the final against Genoa. So a bit of success. And we will see you next time where we look to win the Champions League on the first time of trying with AC Milan in this Return to Glory.